good morning everybody today i'm going to teach you how to install your Thule roof box whew, which also doubles as a great unloaded 36 pound weight let me put this down for a second Today, I am going to teach you how to install your Thule roof box. I had a few people asking me how to do this, so it's a one minute process. Let me show you how. Hi everybody, I'm Nikki Delventhal, and since the winter of 2019 going into 2020, I've been living my unconventional dream of living out of my Prius full time to explore the Americas and its natural beauty. And now, I have my dog with me. He's been with me since September of 2020. My best friend, and now, my little car camper. That's his name, Camper. Mom, why are you trying to take my fort to play in? This is not storage, this is a play fort. Sorry, Camper, not cool. If you're wondering why I'm switching out my roof box, I used to have a medium and now I have a large. Reason being, I went by a garage sale, found it like new for 250 bucks. Score, sold my medium. The large, I like that I could fit more toys in there. Doesn't mean I'm going to. I'm not going to add any more weight, but now I have the option to add skis if I want to pick up a winter sport. So let's get to work, friends. Okay, I centered this. I measured along to make sure it was all even. I moved this bar back about one and a half inches. So that way the weight distribution was even. So I don't have to worry it being back or front heavy. It looks good. And now, really simple, be careful that you don't move the box when you open this. I would recommend maybe opening it before you place it. I might have to double check my measurements because this box is not fun to try to open. Not my favorite box in the world, but it's great for the price. I'm using this as an indicator for measurement. See, it moved back just slightly, like a quarter inch, perfect. And we are golden. Just check from the front and back that it looks good. And now the easy part. You might not need to do any of that prep work. You probably won't need to. So your job should probably only take about 45 seconds. You will take these clamps right here. This way is closed. You'll see how they close and open. Very simple. So what you'll do is you'll open them all the way and then you'll see these slots just like this, right? That's where they go through. You find where the bar intersects with where this is. You go around it with your clamp and you go through and you'll notice underneath it goes right around and then you'll close it right up. Perfect. And you will go ahead and you'll do the same thing for all four. Line it up, pop it in and close it. Good thing this box that I made holds a ton of weight and it's very sturdy. Going across and popping it in. Closing it and last one. Woo! And close it up. And there you have it. 45 second install on your Thule roof box. Personally, if I had unlimited amounts of money and could use any roof box I want, they do have one that opens on both sides and it's not so hard to open. That would be my decision. There you go. Thanks for watching everybody. And that is how you do a one minute install of your Thule roof box. Don't forget, like, subscribe, share with your friends. Camper and I will teach you everything you need to know and show you everything you need to see. See you next time. Come here, baby. I've literally had my shirt on backwards all day. Hmm. Nothing new. I can fit more toys up there, which is gonna happen. Also, 
anyone out there has mountain bikes, I need a sponsor. Garage sales are awesome. Don't forget to subscribe.